I bring in all the wishes and greetings to Dr. Jayadatya Ghosh for scoring a CML rank of 3 and AML rank of 7 uh, in the specialty of DM endocrinology in NEET SS session 2022. Thank Best you, and Thank congratulations you. to you, Doctor. Thank you so much, sir. Can we know a brief background about uh, yourself uh, from where you started and uh, uh, why are you I mean, interested in uh, DM endocrinology? Yes, sir. So I am from Kolkata, West Bengal. I did my MBBS from Bakura Shamilani Medical College, uh, West Bengal, and I have done my MD General Medicine from IPG MER, Kolkata. Uh, from when I got into IPG MER, endocrinology department here is very well uh, equipped here. So and the and my medicine ward was just beside the endocrinology ward. So I used to uh, have an interaction with the endocrinology seniors mm -hmm. and sirs during my rounds and during my posting in endocrinology, I grew my increased amount of attention to endocrinology. From there on, I uh, decided that it's endocrinology that my career would be on that only. Excellent, excellent, wonderful. Now, um, where, how you started your preparation, how did you prepare and what all you did to reach this rank? So, at the starting of my residency, I started reading endocrinology from Harrison as everyone does. That is the mother book of medicine. But uh, when I started the third year of my residency, I started to feel that had going through Harrison and go, uh, solving the MCQs were a bit difficult because it was not possible to get every detail which is required in MCQ studies. So I subscribed to speed in the third year of my residency. I mean, third year of my residency and started watching the Williams videos, which were very helpful for me. And from that, I, ha I used to jot down the notes and that notes became my Bible for getting <laughs> this thing. Very nice, very nice. Yes, sir. Okay, how many hours you used to prepare and how you used to prepare? Uh, I mean, do you watch videos or do you read Williams or uh, how you put MCQs? What are the methodology? Yes, sir. So, uh, I am, after passing my MD in 2021 August, I was doing my SR ship in the same hospital which I had passed my MD. So I could not get so much time to devote on my studies because I had to do my work parallelly. So I used to watch the videos and jot it down and that was the highlighting part of it. So uh, in the whenever I used to get time, I used to go back to the videos and watch the videos and jot the notes down and from the notes I used to st study back. Sirs like um, Uttyo Gupta sir, Rajan Pulai sir, Kranti ma'am and Manasa ma'am were awesome with their videos and <laughs> Manasa ma'am's uh, William Stables high yielding uh, videos were very good. We had a very interactive session in the, in that part. And so before the December INISS part ma'am had already finished the William Stables videos and that was very helpful because I had not gone through William's whole, just a part of the pediatric endocrinology part maybe. But apart from that, I used to go through the notes and that was uh, well enough for me. Excellent, excellent, wonderful. Very, very nice, uh, very nice uh, appreciation. People will definitely be happy and faculties will be definitely happy in seeing this video. Yes. Sir. Now, did you go through all the model tests and grant tests which are given? Yes, sir. The model test and grant test, I had gone through all of them because they used to give me an uh, idea about what part was lacking in me. Because even after going through the notes, some parts I had missed maybe just overlooked or I had forgotten but so by going through the model questions and tests that gave me an idea about what I should look forward because there are certain points certain parts of endocrinology which are questions more are most are more asked from that part so by going through those tests I got a fair amount of idea about which parts to focus on more so it helped me a lot in that part as well the tests were very good sir excellent how many questions were you able to attend this exam? So, uh, so this is my second attempt. I in the last INISS December part, I had ranked eighth in endocrinology. So, but there were six seats, so I missed out by a whisker. So, uh, this was my second attempt, and in this one, I, uh, I had attempted seventy-six questions uh, this time. On seeing the marks, I came to know that I had at, uh, done seventy questions right and six questions were wrong because I had got a marks of sixty-eight. So. Calculating that from that it came so. Now what is the position now? Six seats, seventh rank. Uh, so the, there are seven seats uh, this time, sir. Okay. Now yes, correct uh, on the edge. Yes. Uh, sir. What uh, this is what people say: the God's grace, luck, everything is right on the seventh. 
yes uh, so yes. i could see that i could see i've been very very fortunate and very nice very nice i'm very happy for you and yes, what nice will be your message and uh, advice to all those people who are aiming for endocrinology dm so for endocrinology uh, so it's not possible for uh, anyone to complete williams to uh, in toto so for me the advice would be go through the videos in there and there they have concise the matter the entire tables of williams and everything is there so if we go through the videos in thoro then other things are not at all required and after going through the questions we can get a fair amount of idea about wh- which parts to focus and which parts not to focus so the video should be the bible for uh, targeting endocrinology i think so that that worked for me excellent so which aims you are going to take which so, place you are going to take Uh, I think PGI Chandigarh will be there because my CML rank is third, so I will get through that. Excellent, excellent, very nice, very nice, very nice. And um, once again, I wish you all the best, all the Thank success you, in years Thank to you, come sir. as a great endocrinologist in the country. Thank you, sir. And definitely in PGI Chandigarh, once you finish, and uh, it's it is out to the world, and you will be doing fantastically. And uh, for that, all the best wishes to you, to all your family members, friends, and relatives. Keep going. Best wishes to you. Thank you sir thank you so thank much you, thank you